Hi, Zach Dobson here with another Friday photo tip. This week we're going to talk about getting out in the snow. Um, it can really mess with your light meter, so there's some extra steps that you have to take to um, make sure you're getting good exposure in the snow. So let's get into it. Basically the problem with your camera's light meter in the snow is that it's trying to take an average reading of all white. So what that does is it makes it darker to where the white bright snow looks more of a gray tone and everything else is um, underexposed by a lot. So what you want to do is if you're shooting in manual, you'll want to overexpose according to the light meter by one to two stops. If you're using a camera on automatic, you can go into the menu and adjust for this. Um, look for some sort of exposure compensation feature that will let you say, you know, plus one or plus two um, and go in that range when you're taking your photos. Let's look at some real world examples. This first image was taken at the correct exposure according to the light meter. The second image is one stop overexposed. This one is two stops overexposed. Uh, looking at these in post, I like the around the one stop overexposure, I think looks best. And here is the edited version that I worked off of that one. Thanks for joining us for another Friday photo tip. If you've got some snow, get outside, give some of these tips a try then hashtag your results ZDP photo challenge and let us see what you got. I'll share images in my Instagram stories and um, leave some comments and thanks for stopping by. Keep it real.